Hi, my name is Sarah Feckety, and I played for the University of Tennessee and Team USA. I'd like to take a minute and share with you my e-mask story. The protection of an e-mask is unbelievable. It's been hit by a bat, hit by a 100 mile an hour fastball, been run over by a car, and even hit with a sledgehammer, and nothing breaks it. It's made out of the same hard plastic as bulletproof glasses, and it also offers a wider visibility range because you're not looking through any bars. When wearing a wire mask, it's sometimes hard to pick up the pitch because you have all these bars in front of your face. Um, there's so many times that you can actually lose the release point because your, your vision goes through all these different phases of bars that you have to try to pick up a pitch through. I actually got hit by a pitch when I was wearing a wire mask. I ended up breaking my jaw. Um, it was like a wishbone when it made contact, it split from where it hit in the front of my jaw. I lost all of my muscle mass and um, lost a lot of weight and my performance drastically dropped. I think my bat and average ended up dropping by 114 points. The team and my trainers were really in search of a mask that would, that would protect me that was an alternative to a wire mask. And um, from the initial switch from the wire mask to the e-mask, I noticed an immediate difference. Not only was my vision clearer because there's nothing to block to tamper with your vision, it covers all of your jawline than co really compared to the wire mask. During the World Series, I actually got hit in the face again. There. After I was hit and laying on the ground, all of these emotions just started flooding my mind. But the EMAS, it did its job and it protected my face. Last year, Sarah Feckety got hit in the jaw by a pitch. This year, the football team put them onto a new company called EMAS, and it looks like she's okay. This e-mask that's clear and that has protection up underneath the jaw so balls cannot pop up in there and get to that jawline. Boy, think of the damage if she hadn't have had that super e-mask on made out of that fiberglass this year. As a coach and as a parent, you always want to protect your players. By sending them to the plate wearing a wire mask, you're not guaranteeing their safety. Why do I wear an e-mask? Because it works. Why should your players wear an e-mask? because they're worth it.